Hey beauties, welcome back to my channel, Modest Transformation. Today we're going to be diving into something super exciting, bold, vibrant eye colors that make a statement. Whether you're new to experiencing with bright shades or a seasoned pro, I'm here to show you the process of creating stunning looks that will turn heads and leave a lasting impression. So, let's get started. Okay, guys, welcome back. I'm going to use Ruby Kisses Madagascar Forest and Aquarius Eyeshadow Palettes to do this vibrant statement makeup tutorial. So I'm going to use my Madagascar Forest Eyeshadow Palette. I'm using the second row, the first color. It's like a reddish color, and I mix it with a dark brown. So I mix those two colors together to make the color more of a pop <laughs> in other words I was trying to find a word to say it but I'm mixing those two colors together so you guys can see the transition of colors which I love saying and doing um, which everybody call it the smoky eye so I'm just blending out the colors and you know I'm making sure that that brown will show so when I transition to the other color it'll show that it's um, it's a cut crease in other words so I'm just blending the outer side of my eye so I'm making sure that it shows because sometimes certain colors don't show on my skin tone so I'm making sure that it's dark brown do so I am just blending uh, very carefully and I'm going to use my uh, light green it's like a lime green color I'm playing it in the inner corner of my eye because I want to do something a little different. I was kind of scared of doing something different and being bold. So, you know, you can't never be afraid of doing bold colors. So, I said, you know what? I'm going to do it. So, I'm applying more of the lighter green in the, in the corner of my eye. And I'm blending it out so you guys can see the transition once again. So, I am just applying going back and forth. And... I was kind of hesitant. I didn't know what other colors to do with this look. So I'm just going back in blending the light green. And I said, you know what? I'm going to apply some green um, shimmer, which is glitter. And I'm applying it in the middle of my eye. And I'm using my finger. Because sometimes using brush can be a little bit messy. So I said, you know what? I'm just going to use different um, glitter. So as you guys can see, I have one that's kind of like a chromosome color, a dark purple, um, silver, and then like a bluish color. So I'm just using that to like a chromosome glitter look, and I'm just applying it um, to the middle of my eye as well. I'm going to use my 2-in-1 foundation um, by Absolute New York. It's called Cool Cafe Number no. 5. And I'm applying that around my eye. And I'm going to go in with Mika K06. It's Carto. And then um, I think I usually go in with the guys. Cappuccino. Um, I do three or two concealers because my I have warm undertones. And I'm going to use my setting spray by e.l.f., um, which is one of my favorites. It's a light mist and it's perfect. And I'm just going to take my sponge and blend. And as you guys can see, it take it don't take no time for the colors to blend properly. And it looks just like my skin tone. So I love applying um, those concealers. And I love it to look very natural. So I don't want to make it like I have on makeup. So um, I do love how this makes my eyes pop underneath. And it gives it more of a flawless look. So I'm very pleased of that um, I used to have a hard time finding the different shades of concealers that match that match my skin tone so I apply three or two concealers so I really don't use foundation that much but mostly concealer is my favorite to use so I'm just making sure that my concealer is blended in perfectly because trust me you do not want it to have <laughs> um, blotches of makeup here and there so you want to make sure all around that it's blended perfectly so it can look very natural so now 
I'm going to go back in. I'm going to use some, like a gold color, like a shimmer gold. And I'm going to apply that at the bottom of my, um, my eye, my, um, bottom eye. And I'm just applying the gold. So I want the, my eyes to pop a little bit more because it's like a bold, vibrant, bold color. So I want it to pop more. And I really love how the transition of the colors linked in very well. The gold, the green, the, like the bluish um, shimmer of glitter and then the green and the brown. So it looks very good. And I'm just cleaning up the where I place my eyeliner of makeup eyeshadow as eyeliner and it's a great hack to use because if you don't have eyeliner you can use your eyeshadow Good and it goes morning. on very perfectly and you don't have to worry about it it makes your eyes pop so I did one side of my face so this is the final look and I did the other side so now it's time for the lip tutorial now I'm using this color brown uh, lip liner now you guys won't believe what kind of lip liner it is. It is gel eyeliner that I'm using. Um, when I use regular eyeliner, it don't usually show up like this. So I didn't mind. I love how it just goes smooth on my lips. So I always buy eyeliner for my lips if that's weird. But I mean, it goes on perfectly. I feel like the breast doll. And I'm using the Nika K lip gloss. Uh, bubble gum and look how vibrant my lips are I definitely feel like the breast doll very moorish and settled and I feel complete and I really love it and I'm going to use my foundation two-in-one foundation and I'm going to apply it around my lip just a little bit, not too much, because I really didn't have to, um, but just a little bit because I want it to be right with my lips. So I'm going to go in and blend out that concealer. I usually spray setting spray on my brush, but I didn't do it this time, but it still went on perfectly. It blended in perfectly, and look how natural it looks, like my skin. It looks flawless. It don't even look like I have on makeup. It's just like I just put like some lotion or something on my face. and But it looks really good. Um, I always love to try out new colors. If you enjoyed this tutorial, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more beauty tips and tricks. And I'd love to see your bold eye look. So tag me in your photos on social media. Thank you guys for watching and I will definitely see you guys in the next one. And uh, thank you guys and uh, like, share, and subscribe. Bye. Oh, and I will leave the makeup palettes in the description down below. Thank you guys for tuning in. See you guys. Bye.